Once upon a time, in the district of Papar, lived a man called Macau Serin. He was famous in the land for his skill in medicine and for the manner in which he could mix healing potions and make magic charms. One evening, Macau Serin was taking a stroll along a river when he heard, Please help me. Macau Serin looked around and saw an old man weeping. What is the matter? My daughter is dying. She has choked on a fish bone, and no one could help to get it out. I heard you can heal anything. Please help my daughter. We do need a transport to go there. Let me get my horse first. You don't have to. I can help you with that. The old man transformed to a crocodile and Macau Serin was shocked to see the seemingly magical physical changes. How can this be possible? I am a war crocodile, Macau Serin. It is a curse and a gift. Hop on my back and I will take you straight to my daughter through this river. Macau Serin jumped over the crocodile's back and away they went. They arrived at a settlement not far from where Macau Serin lived and they went straight to the old man's house. The daughter was laying on her bed, weak and sobbing in pain. I am here to help you. Let me take a look. With a quick examination, Macau Serin pulled out a golden hairpin from the daughter's throat. She is fine now. She just needs to rest. Thank you. What a relief. You are a great healer, Macau Serin. It was nothing. I am just doing my best to help the people. I am rewarding you with one of our precious assets. I really think you deserve it. This sword will penetrate anything in this world. Macau Serin took the sword and immediately returned to his village. Once he arrived, he immediately alerted the villagers. There was a settlement far from this place and it appeared that they have been stealing our churches and wars, turning our people into their mills. They can transform into crocodiles. If not so, we must bring them to justice. But if they can transform to crocodiles, they must be so hard to beat and capture. I have a magical sword that can penetrate anything, even the skin of crocodiles. In that case, we will send our best warriors with you as our leader, Mukal Serin. I will do anything to protect our people. The villagers attacked the kingdom. Many people died during the battle. And the last duel between the old man and Mukal Serin. It was clear that there could be one of them that will come out alive. Mukau Serin, I will never forgive you for what you did. You and your people have been attacking us, killing us and stealing us. It needs to end. Mukau Serin plunged the magical sword into the skin of the old man who had turned into a crocodile all the way to his heart. From now on, we will attack humans whenever we see them. You, humans, have no match against us. So long we have ways to protect ourselves. We will never fear you and your kind. The old man finally took his last breath. The villagers led by Macau Serin won the battle. They returned safely to their homes. However, from that day onwards, humans are always under the threat of being attacked by crocodiles which were believed to be the descendants of the old man who swore that his people would continue to hunt 
every human.